this look is crazy I know I have pink eyes and bluish purplish grayish lips I know it's crazy but um, I wanted to test out some new products with y'all so that's what we did in this video if you were interested in how I got this look or interested in the new products that I tested out then just keep watching the first thing that I'm gonna do is my eyebrows and I got this new pomade so we're going to just try it out and I'm gonna use my unique double-ended brush so one side is the angle and the other side is the spoolie and we're just going to start tracing my eyebrows and filling them in I've never tried this so Let's see how it goes. Also, I already plumped my lips. I know they look crazy. I used this little apple. Um, I will do a video over it if y'all would like to see that. But just let me know in the comments below. It is crazy how big you can get your lips by using that little guy. Um, I'm sorry, you can probably hear lawn mowing outside. It's supposed to rain all weekend, so we wanted to go ahead and get the lawn out of the way but I'm just filling these in or actually I'm tracing them and then I will go fill them in this is kind of hard to use because it's kind of waxy it's not really wanting to adhere to my skin so we might go in with a pencil okay so there's one brow I'm going to go in with my brow palette from Unique and fill it in the rest of the way because this kind of sucks, but um, I'll do my other brow off camera. Okay, so I finished my brows and I went ahead and um, primed my lids and set them. So now I'm going to go in with this palette. Um, I have never used this, so we're going to kind of do a review over it as well. So the first shade that I'm going to jump right into for my transition is this shade right here. And we're just going to pop that right in. These shades are super chalky, and there's a lot of kickback, so. And it kind of doesn't show up, the shade doesn't at least, because I guess it kind of matches the shade that I use to set. I'm going to hop into this shade right here, which is just a light pink shade. It looks orange, but it's actually a light pink, and we're going to put that in my crease as well. I'm gonna go in with this shade right here which is just a sparkly shade and we're just gonna put that all over okay so that actually has no pigment at all and it just looks like sparse glitter so um, I'm gonna go in with the pink and see if it's a little better okay no so the glitters suck I'll swatch it even the swatch is really fair. So I'm gonna hop into a different palette. I'm gonna go in with my Unique 25 palette because these are the best shades ever because they're so pigmented. And I'm gonna go back in with that flat brush and I'm going to use this shade right here which is called Gentle. And we're just going to pop that all over the lid. See, that's the pigment I need in my life. So pretty. Okay, so I also got a new mascara. This is the Fat Lash Mascara. It just looks like this. And it's from AOA Studio. It was a dollar. This is what the wand looks like. And I am not open to trying new mascaras because y'all know that my favorite mascara ever is the Epic. So we're going to see if I like it. is kind of flimsy which I don't really like that because I'm used to a stiff one but other than that I like it
Okay, so this is after three coats. I'm not very impressed because I figured it would have a lot more. The more mascara I actually was applying, they were clumping together, so I didn't like that either, and they would not dry. They felt super wet, but, um, I mean, for a dollar, you can't really complain, but that's just my input. For primer, I'm gonna go in with the Nature by Nature Flash Matte Perfecting Primer. Okay, so I put the Unique Mineral Touch foundation on the back of my hand. It looks like this. And I dotted it all over my face. And then um, I'm going to use the AUA Studio High Def Brush, the F8. And we're just going to blend this into my face. Okay, so I already put my concealer down and I'm gonna go in with this new Wonder Bake. This is also um, one of my new items from Miss A. That is where all of these items have been if I haven't been saying that. I'm not going to damp it and I'm gonna go in with the Cody Airspun and we're just going to start packing this to bake. Okay, so I'm going to use a new bronzer today. This is from AOA Studio again, and it's a shimmer bronzer. It doesn't have a name, so I'm not sure what shade it is, but it's just a bunch of shimmers. So we're just going to mix them all together and see how this works. So I just dusted the rest of that air spun into my skin and now I'm going to go in with the Unique Blush in the shade Sweet and I'm just going to use this fluffy brush and we're just going to put this all over. Or I mean on my cheeks, not all over. So I'm going to go in with this Define brush and smoke out my lower lash line with the same pink. I'll use this mirror actually. So I just took the um, pencil liner in plush from Unique and lined and filled in my lips and now I'm going to go in with this liquid lipstick in the shade Cashmere from AOA Studio. It is a matte liquid lipstick and we're just going to see how this looks. Oh Lord. to lock this look in I'm gonna go in with the behold setting spray from unique and just spray okay y'all so we are officially finished with this look I know the lip is super crazy I probably won't wear this but I really just wanted to test it out um, if you have any questions or any requests please drop them below and don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up before you leave bye guys